With the holidays fast approaching, you got that favorite backpacker on your list, but you're not really quite sure what to put in their stocking? Stick around. Leonardo and I are going to help you guys out with that one. Yeah. Back, guys and gals. If you guys are new here to the channel, this is Matty Outdoors. My channel is all about hiking and backpacking. I'm into hammock camping. I'm Canadian. I go to some pretty sweet places in the Rockies. If any of that interests you guys at all, consider clicking on that subscribe button. But like I said in the beginning, today we're talking about stocking stuffers for your favorite backpacker. All right, Leonardo, what do we got for the first one? We're going to talk about the GSI UL Java Drip combined with the GSI UL Backpacker Mug. This is the epitome of perfect coffee in the backcountry. I have tried every kind of dehydrated powdered coffee. I've done cowboy coffee. I've even hiked with a couple of people that use coffee presses. Personally, I'm a pour over coffee fan. So uh, this combo is perfect. I mean, you can get the entire thing for like under 25 bucks. You know, this is super lightweight, flimsy. I got tons of videos on this thing. You guys know I absolutely love this. The backpacker mug. If you guys want a video on the backpacker mug, let me know. The mug itself is freaking awesome. Little plastic cup slides out. Got measurements down the side of the cup. Nice little insulated koozie. The lid, it's got a little rubber seal on it. And a rubber seal at the top here. So it does actually fully seal when you put your hot drink in. A lot of times I'll just put this on the chest strap of my backpack. I'll take my coffee to go with me a lot of times, but yeah, GSI UL backpacker mug combined with a Java drip. Great idea if your backpacker loves coffee. Holy crap, Leonardo, that one was awesome. What do we have next? If you got a backpack in your life, I guarantee they like to eat. Eating utensils. What we got here, this is a Tokes short handle spork. And this is an Optimus long handle spoon. This is aluminum, this is titanium. They're both ridiculously cheap. I mean, I, I think this was 11 bucks and this one I think was about 12 or 13 bucks. Um, they're both super lightweight. Uh, the biggest thing with getting a spork or spoon, make sure you get one that has this polished metal end like both of mine have here. Uh, if you get it and it has this fully anodized coating, you're gonna find a lot of the food sticks to it and they're ridiculously difficult to clean. Just uh, find one with these little nice shiny coatings on them and you know your backpacker will be happy they will thank you that was awesome backpackers love to eat what do you got next you little green dude talk about eluding right this one may be a bit of a touchy subject for some people this is the scorpion pipe from wolf grinders this is the coolest marijuana smoking contraption i have ever seen ever it's uh ridiculously lightweight i'll put weights up on the screen as always but uh, ridiculously lightweight aluminum pipe with a quartz bowl that's removable. So you can pop the bowl out. You know, you've got a little cover and a little pick tool at the end here. Uh, I mean, it's ridiculously lightweight, folds up ridiculously small. I mean, that thing is cool. Uh, if you guys want a full video on this thing, do expect it. That will be coming out soon. Scorpion Pipe from Wolf Grinders. I'll put a link in the description down below. Um, these are actually made locally to me. These are made in Edmonton, so that's super cool to me. But yeah, I, oh, this thing is cool, man. I, it's like a fidget spinner to me. I can't not play with it. But yeah, Scorpion Pipe. Holy crap, moving on from the drugs. Now we're gonna talk about drugs. Advil. Every long distance backpacking trip I have ever done, that's longer than five days, Advil gets traded around camp like it's drugs in prison. It's insane. Uh, just whoever has the Advil is king. So, you know, a bottle of Advil, honestly, for any backpacker is probably going to be ridiculously appreciated. So maybe a great idea if you're stuck on something to get. What else you got for me, you little green guy? Little green stuff sack? The BRS. BRS 3000. Ridiculously lightweight, ridiculously cheap. Like you can get these for like 20 bucks on Amazon. Little backpacking stove. These things are absolutely wicked. If you got a backpacker in your life, chances are if they don't have one of these, they're probably gonna love getting one of these. So yeah, the BRS 3000, ridiculously cheap, fantastic little stove. Great, 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 great stocking stuffer. He's promised me this is the last one. You sure this is the last one, dude? I feel like this video has been going on for a while. Yeah, he says this is the last one. Seriously, bro, the Z seat again? Press Z seat. Uh, I honestly, I, I can't say enough good things about this. I absolutely freaking love this little ass pad. It is insanely warm, ridiculously cheap. You can smack your Ninja Turtle stocking around with it if you want to. 
Yeah, I, I friggin' love this thing. Uh, I, I think everybody needs an ass pad, so, you know, Thermo SZ seat, fantastic stocking stuffer. And that concludes our stocking stuffers. If you guys like this one, smash the thumbs up. Let me know in the comment section. If you guys got any questions about the gear I talked about today, let me know. I would love to help you guys out. As always, guys, I am Maddie. Thank all of you guys so damn much for watching. And I will see you guys on the next one. <laughs> what are you doing? Well, hi. Oh, hello. Oh, it's both of you. Oh, my goodness. Oh, God. You guys are going to knock me over into the freaking tree. You, you can't come on to me, Wanda. Are you serious? Like, you just...